Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Hometastic by Rizwana. In today's video, I'll be showing you three easy peasy DIYs for your home decor that anyone can do. So without much ado, let's get started. So this is the first DIY. For this, I am taking four pots that we get with Kulfi. So this is going to be wall hanging. It's very easy guys. We just have to choose the right colors and paint the pots with those colors. You can choose any colors of your choice but make sure that those are bright colors because it looks more beautiful. And also if you are an artist you can make some good designs on the pots but here I am keeping it plain. Now this is important step here I am applying varnish on top of this to make it look glossy and to prevent the colors from fading out. Because if we apply varnish we can use this wall hanging outside also like in our entrance or balcony. Once the varnish is dry, take a jute rope and wrap it like this. And take another pot and tie it with the rope of little smaller size compared to the first one. So like this keep on reducing the length of the rope uh, compared to the previous one. And here is my wall hanging ready and this looks more beautiful in the balconies or in the entrance. So I'll be using this in my entrance. And you can also pot any small plants in these mini planters. Now moving on to our second DIY here, I will be making a small DIY tray which looks like a marble tray. So for this I am using this lid that came with a phone long time back. Uh, you might be getting this kind of boxes for wallets and all so you can use that type of uh, boxes for this tray. Here I will be using a marble wallpaper that is left over from my previous kitchen makeover. If you don't have wallpaper, you can use any kind of gift wrapping paper and attach it using the fevicol. Now let's cover the inner surface of the tray using a decoupage paper. Here I'm applying deco magic glue on the surface and then I'll attach the paper. I'm applying one more layer of glue on top of this paper and then once it is dried up I'll apply varnish on this to protect it. Thank you. 
my small cute DIY tray is ready so we can decorate this tray like this or we can also use this as a wall frame on the walls so it's just to show you how we can reuse our old boxes or lids and make this kind of beautiful trays and moving on to our third DIY here I am using an empty medicine bottle to make a mini cute flower vase so for that I am using fabricryl molded clay you will get this for 25 rupees and we can make lot of designs and crafts with this kind of clay so we need to take equal amounts of clay from both the packets and mix it very well until it becomes white in color and I am rolling it using a marker you can use anything to roll this now keep on applying that clay on the bottle until it becomes even and fully covered here I am also rolling the bottle to make the layer even So I have covered the full bottle like this and here I am just applying some water to make it look glossy. And I got this wooden block from Itsy Bitsy, it's just for 20 or 30 rupees. So using that block I am making some flat design on this. So I have just made this design all over the bottle. So the clay is completely dried and also I had painted it white I forgot to capture that and I am giving a stroke of golden color on these flowers to make it look more beautiful. Painting is completed, now let's cover the neck of the bottle using a geotrope. Meanwhile I have a request for you, whatever you have liked in today's video or disliked or you have any better suggestions, do let me know in the comment section, I would love to hear from you all. So that's it guys here is my cute mini flower vase ready you can use this on any center table so you can style it anywhere so that's all for today friends hope you liked my today's video and uh, if you have really liked my video please press the like button and also if you are new to my channel do consider subscribing to my channel as i'll be coming up with affordable home decor home organizing and diy videos every week and also don't forget to press the bell icon so that you won't miss the notifications of my videos. So that's all for today friends. Let's meet in the next video. Until then bye bye and take care.